Hey there guys, what's up? Welcome to another RoboFet uh, E3 podcast. Uh, this is the second one I've done so far. So basically, we're going to talk about the fact that Microsoft kind of dropped a humongous bomb on us today. I also want to say uh, that I'm sorry. Um, I had to work today and it really, really sucked. I had to miss out on a lot of stuff. So I had a lot of catching up to do. But trust me, I did everything to get uh, my video out as soon as possible. Anyway, Microsoft just announced today that they're going to make the Xbox One backwards compatible to the 360. That's right, you can play 360 games on the Xbox very soon. I almost I almost can't even believe it. They're gonna make it also so that if you have an Xbox Live account on a 360 or an Xbox One, you can play with those people. You can play with people that have an Xbox 360. Those people can play with people who have Xbox Ones. It's so incredible. It's also kind of worrisome though, and here's why. Most game developers have given up on the 360. They, it's done, as well as the PS3. And now this backwards combat compatibility thing is coming out. And for games that have come out for a little while, people might think, hmm, I think I might save a couple bucks and buy the 360 version and just play it on the Xbox One and forsake the 1080p. Honestly, I don't know why we are still going on about 1080p. 4K is here, that's the future. Quit going on about 1080p. Also, we live in the age of remasters. Everybody wants to remaster their games. We got the Master Chief collections, we got the Uncharted, they remastered Fable, they remastered, they just want to remaster everything. They want to milk that cash cow as long as they can. They did say on the stage that it will be a slow process and they have to get permission from each developer <laughs> to do this, guys. That just sucks. And you know why it is. A lot of them haven't decided whether they want to remaster their game or not. And I can't tell you how many are probably going to say, No, we could probably still make a couple bucks there. Because, to be honest with you, uh, Microsoft is doing this, one, I think, to show up Sony. And two, they want to push more Xbox Ones. They want to sell as many of those bad boys as possible. So I'm not going to say that they're doing this out of the goodness of their heart. But really, they if you think about it, they didn't have to do it. They didn't have to go back and say, you know what, we're going to make those 360 games able to, you're just going to be able to play them on the Xbox One. They're not doing that out of the goodness of their own heart. It's not what's happening here. But at the same time, it was nice and they didn't have to do it. I'm just worried that a lot of developers are going to say, hey, you know, uh, this is not a good thing for us. And then uh, the titles that will that you'll be able to play on the Xbox One will be limited. I also hope that it doesn't, you know, uh, because they're they're going to be doing a lot of this stuff, that it's not going to slow down anything on the Xbox One or anything like that. Technical. They also announced that they will be releasing the Rare Collection. That's right. Rare. All the games rare. All the games rareware. Ugh, say that a million times fast. All the games rareware has made over the years. I think it's like 100 titles or something like that. Conker's Bad Fur Day is going to be on there. Banjo-Kazooie is going to be on there. Battletoads is going to be on there. And dude, Perfect Dark. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait for that to come out. Microsoft, you guys, I tip my hat to you. You know, and they're kind of trying to show up Sony a little bit, I think. As to be expected. Um, and I gotta tip my hat to them. They're doing all the right things to sell their- to push and sell their consoles. Anyway guys, my overall opinion is, I am really excited. This is really, really, really good news. I can't wait to pop my first 360 game into that Xbox One console. Uh -huh. Anyway guys, that's it for this one. Keep tuning in this week. Uh, I'm gonna keep talking about stuff. I'm gonna keep making more videos. And we're gonna get through this together. Carl! Carl! We're gonna get through this together. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Keep watching. You can always like, comment, rate, subscribe, you know all that good stuff. Until the next update, keep those punish rats on and I'll see you later.